Hi, my Kayla crew. Welcome back. So it's been about a week since I posted a video and a week has been too long. I really missed you guys. It's just been a crazy busy week with work and you know, more things going on, but I'm happy to be back and I've got a lot of filming to do. I've got a short story, which I'm going to share with you today. I've got a wantable, I've got a trunk here. I have an Amazon prime here and I've got a couple more on the way. I've got a stitch fix on the way and a transcend on the way. So we're going to be busy. So let's get started today with my short story because I've got to check out today. So let's go through my box and see what's inside this month's box. Okay, so I have two pairs of denim in this box, which actually makes me very happy. You guys know I love my denim. I thought I would start off with this pair because I thought it looked nicely with the top that I had on. This top came from a Wantable box. I think it was late fall, maybe early fall last year. Anyway, these um, these are by Democracy. They're both by Democracy. These are the Absolution Light Wash Crop in light blue, size 16 petite. They're $73. I feel like that's a bit pricey for Democracy, but you guys let me know. Um, they do have your classic five pocket style. They do zip and button up in front. Um, and they are supposed to be a crop. I think these are close to being there for me. So, so since this is a petite box, this is nice because they fit me a little bit better. What do you think about them? I like the wash of them a lot. They are cuffed. I could probably cuff them once more to make them even more of a crop. Let me know what you think. Here's the side. Let me show you the back. So I think the fit is nice overall. I do like them. You know what? Let me try to cuff them. Hang on. Okay, so I cuffed them once more. So that's what they look like cuffed once more. So even more of a crop. Now, I don't think that they're a stitched crop. So let's see how they look. Maybe I can even have these do double duty, wear them as a crop and wear them as a straight or skinny jean. So hang on. Okay, so here's what they look uncuffed. So you can wear them as more of a skinny jean. This type of jean would be good if you wear like tucked into boots in the fall. I'm thinking ahead, but serves kind of double duty, right? What do you think about the jeans? I like them, they're very comfortable. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them. I'm gonna try on the other pair. I do like the wash of these a lot and I like that they looked they looked pretty good cuffed, I think. I'm gonna watch back too. You guys let me know what you think. I think we're gonna go right to the other pair of denim and then we'll go to the tops. We'll kind of do things backwards this time. I know, we usually do the tops first, but we're gonna just go with it today. Okay, next pair of denim. I think this also looks nice with this top. These are super comfortable. The first ones were comfortable. I don't know what it is about these. They're really, really comfortable. Okay, so these are also by Democracy. These are the Absolution Modern Mid-Rise Ankle Jeans. They are in the color Indigo, size 16 Petite. They are $78. I feel like these prices are a bit higher for Democracy. I think in my previous boxes, this one and others, I've paid about like 60 for Democracy, which seems like it's Democracy's average price. I don't know, maybe it went up a little bit. I do really like these jeans a lot. They do have your classic five pocket style. They're super, super comfortable. Love the dark wash. I wear my dark wash jeans in the summertime and I lighten it up, you know, with a top like this that's colorful or the lighter colored top, you know, on top. I think dark wash jeans are flattering on me. They hide what I want them to hide. They look slimming. I really, I really, really like these. Yep, I like the length of them. The length is perfect. These would go right into fall too. So I may end up keeping these even though they're a bit pricey because I do love them. And you guys know I love my denim. So, yep. Let me know what you think. Here's the back. Yeah, I like these a lot. I don't want to take them off. That's how I know I should keep them if I don't want to take them off. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, the first pair was comfortable too and I liked the wash of them, but there's something about these that just feels really, really nice. And I love my Democracy jeans and I'm happy with these. So these may end up staying with me. I know they're a bit pricey, so that's the only thing, but I do like them a lot. Okay, let me grab the tops and we'll start talking about the tops that came in this box. Okay, we've clearly got some fit issues with this top. This top seems cute when you pull it out of the box, and on the right person, it would be really cute, but no. Let me tell you what it is. This is by In Loom. It's the three quarter sleeve embroidery peasant top in Marigold. They sent me a size large and said it fits like an extra large, which may be true if it wasn't for the bust area, which makes my bust area look totally unflattering. It almost looks like it's flattening it out, doesn't it? What is going on? It's totally not my bra. <laughs> I promise it's this top. I can feel it flattening it out. So anyway, <laughs> this is $44. 
the fabric on this is 100% rayon and then the embroidery is 100% cotton. You have to hand wash this in cold water. It is made in China. So let's talk about this top. <laughs> I just, you know, it's not flattering. Um, I'll come close so you can see the embroidery. That's really pretty. I love the design. It's almost got like some upside down hearts. Almost looks like it's got some crosses. And then what do you think? What is this? I can't see, but really cute. I love the embroidery and I like the feel of this. I don't mind rayon. I know rayon wrinkles easily, but it's a nice fabric for the summertime. It does have the elastic sleeves, which is nice. They're not too tight, so it doesn't bother me. It's got a little bit of flowiness to it. And I think if you've got a smaller chest, because you guys know I have a larger chest. If you've got a smaller chest, this might work like I'm trying to <laughs> trying to see how it would look but yeah nope we can totally tell because this is a little bit um there's no stretch here so I think this is supposed to come over your chest <laughs> so anyway let me show you the back of it so yeah this one's going back and I'm gonna get this shirt off because yeah just not flattering all right let's move I hope you guys get a good laugh out of this at least all right let's move on to the next piece Okay, clearly the bottoms, the denim, are the winners in this box. From the front, this top looks fine. Nothing special, but nothing really wrong with it. Wait till I turn around. It's one of those twist tops. I don't even know if I'm going to show you when I turn around. It depends on how it looks because it's one of those twist tops where it's open. And if I'm not comfortable showing you, it's not going to make it to the footage. <laughs> Maybe just so you can see how it looks. I don't know. We'll see how it comes out. So let me tell you what this is. This is by Muse Petite. It's the Naomi Twist Back Top Size Extra Large Petite. It is $44. The fabric is 70% modal and 30% polyester. Now with this top, it says it's made in the USA and it says to either hang dry or dry clean. Yeah, a top like this is dry clean. So that's, you know, if I really love a top, I'll make it work. And I've done that before. I've kept a couple of tops from other boxes that are dry clean only and I've made it work. This top is not special enough for me to keep. It is a little bit short. I think I've come to the conclusion that I need petites for my bottom, but not my top half. So I think that's why I don't have much luck with tops in this box. I do have really good luck with their dresses, with their jumpsuits and with their bottoms, just not always tops. Sometimes there are some cardigans and things that I receive that really work for me, but the tops in this box didn't. <laughs> but that's okay. They're not always winners. Um, I do really like the way that this fabric feels. It's nice and soft. Um, I like the sleeve length on this. I think the color is really, really pretty. So here's the front. I don't know if you're going to see the back. Let's see if it makes it. I'll turn around. If not, I'll show you in the recap. I don't know how things look back there. So we'll see if it made it. So yep, this one's going back. I just wouldn't pull for it. I wouldn't feel comfortable. Even I wouldn't wear a cami and, you know, have like a lace cami. I just wouldn't do that personally. But if you are a person that would do that, if you would wear it like that, then this would be a cute top for summertime would look cute with white shorts and things like that. So yep, this one's going to go back. Oh, I have a necklace. So let me grab the necklace and I'll put it on with this top. Okay, now here's the necklace. Now the necklace is by Make-A-Wish. It's the Linked Rings Charms Metal Necklace in gold. It is $22, so not a bad price. The only thing that's bothering me about this necklace, I think it's cute. I It kind of looks like it's twisting a bit, and I've tried to like fuss with it to make it lay correctly, but it's just, it keeps twisting. But that there's what it looks like. I like the style. I like the chain link style, and I do like the um, kind of, what do they, they call this? The double hoop, is that what they called it? I already forgot. Oh, the rings. Yeah, so I do like that, but I kind of wish there was three and just like this size on the other, just to make it a little bit more symmetrical. <laughs> Can you tell my OCT is kicking in a little bit? So yeah, I just kind of wish there were three. It's cute, but this twisting all day would drive me crazy. And I've just put it on and I just walked from, you know, the house, the porch to <laughs> the backyard, which is not far and it just keeps twisting so it's cute but i wish there was another you know ring here and i wish it would lay flat but so this one's going back okay i'll meet you in the recap okay so this is the top that has the twisted back so this is what it looks like 
because I'm not sure if the footage made it in or not. We'll see. So it, like I said, on the right person, I think it would be super cute. It's got this band across the back. The twist is super cute too. Love the color. It's just not flattering on me. And I don't think I'd be comfortable. I know I wouldn't be comfortable in it. So I'm going to send this one back. But yeah, on the right person, this would look super cute. So yeah, just not on me. And this yellow top was totally not flattering on me. But I did love, see, out of the box, doesn't it look cute? You pulled it out, oh, that's a cute top, and then you put it on, it just whew, flattened me out. <laughs> but that's because I've got the bigger chest, so, you know, yep. But I did want to show you, I don't think I pointed out that throughout the top, it's kind of got this, like, crochet detail that goes down the front, goes underneath the embroidery, and is along the back, too. So it's a super cute concept. It just didn't work right for me. The lighter color Democracy jeans are going back too. I liked them, but I can't take these off. I wish that today was casual Friday for work because I'd wear these today. But yep, so I think I'm gonna save them for tomorrow and wear them tomorrow to work. These are a good pair of jeans. I can wear jeans to work every Friday. And these are a nice clean pair, no distressing um, to wear to work on casual Friday. So these are gonna stay with me. I know they're a bit pricey for democracy, but I love them. They make me happy and that's what matters, right? And I can buy denim again. So yep, these are gonna stay with me, $78. I do have a little bit of credit. So if you used my short story link, thank you so much. It really does help me out. So I have my styling fee to apply to. So it'll bring down the cost a bit. So yep. This was fun. It was good to spend time with you again. Let me know how you're doing below. You're gonna see some more of me. I'm Today's, what's today? Thursday, tomorrow's Friday. So I'm gonna film a lot over the weekend and I'm off a little bit next week too from work. So I'm gonna go do some shopping over the weekend. I've got a couple of places that I've been wanting to go, just haven't had the time. So if I do, maybe I'll bring you along with me. So thanks so much for watching and for spending some time with me today. I really appreciate it. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you really soon for another video.